because I'm gonna film a what I get for Christmas and the reason why I didn't film it earlier is because I wanted to combine it with a winter haul because almost all the things I get are clothes but it seems that me and my mom are going to this shopping center only at the end of January so I just can't wait till the end of January for filming a what I get for Christmas video so here I am basically into this video of course I'm gonna show you all the things I get for Christmas and if you're interested just keep on watching so the third things that I get for Christmas is this cutest here. Now I don't know if you can tell but this is actually a scarf and it is from Alcott and my friends gave it to me and I was so excited because it was something that I just wanted a lot and she bought it for me and you know I'm just so obsessed. I just love how this scarf looks like. It is so fuzzy and it's definitely warm and I think I will wear it a lot during the winter time. And you know, it's something that everybody has to have, like you can't live without one of those scarves. So the reason why I was able to share with you guys what my friend gave to me is that we decided to exchange present earlier this year. But I didn't start school yet, so I'm not able to share with you guys the things that my other friends give to me. So I think we're just gonna pass to the things that my parents give to me. So at the first place, we got something very random and I am talking about candies. So I got some candy canes because I totally love them. They look so good and they are so super yummy. So yeah, they give them to me. So before of Christmas, me and my parents went to the opener market. And if you guys don't know what is the opener market, I will leave them below the video that I did there. It's a vlog, so if you want to check it out, it's in the description. But anyway, we went there and I fall in love with a lot of clothes. And my mom and my dad gave them to me like as a gift. And my mom says that those were a Santa gift. So I just thought that I will include them. Uh, so starting with but these eyed waisted shorts, I love them. They are like the 50s and the 20s style and I just am obsessed with those styles. So I just love how they look like, that is cute detail with the bottoms and I just think they go super well with another things that I get from there. And basically I am talking about these beautiful um, shirts. So this is how it looks like and I just love it. It is in this kind of cute color, this roses color. And it has also some cute flowers on it. And I just love also the rouge that it has. It's so 20s. And usually I'm not a big fan of this kind of rouge. But when I first saw it, I am, I fell in love with it. Like I was like, I am in love. So I, you know, my parents just get that to me. And I also love this cute ribbon, like it's a velvet black ribbon and of course you just can do a bow and I think it looks so good. Then the next thing that my parents give to me, it's a sweater and I am obsessed with it. So this is how it looks like and it's not the classical white sweater because it has this cute detail on uh, the shoulder that I think make it super cute. So it has this kind of ribbon that goes through it and then it turns up with a bow and I just love it. I saw those sweater all the way down on Forever 21 and I wanted to get one of those for so long and now my parents give that to me and I think it looks so cute. Then the next thing, that's also the last thing that I get from the opener market is this one here. So this is a um, glasses case and uh, this is how it looks like. So it has this kind of uh, roses color in, uh, you know, when you first open it. And uh, I just love it. It has these cute details and also some roses. And I think, you know, just super cute to pick up my sunglasses with me. Then the main things that I got for this Christmas is this iPod Pro. So it is on the color rose gold and no guys, I didn't get a new iPod Pro. This is still my first one. So if you follow me in a while, you will know that I get an iPod Pro and I also did the unboxing of it. So I will leave the link of that in the post down below. Be sure to go and check it out if you haven't already because it is a pretty good video. 
Uh, but yeah, so I got this iPad Pro as an earlier Christmas gift for myself because usually I was filmed with the, my iPhone 5C but uh, there was a problem with it and all the times that I want to film something I didn't have the memory for doing that and I just hate this so I decided to get an iPad Pro for filming and I'm filming with it right now this is the reason why I can actually show you the iPad and I'm just gonna show you the blocks uh, so yeah, I get an iPad Pro and I'm super happy with it and of course uh, I buy it with my money but my mom sell me with it because I didn't have all the money uh, So yeah, I get an iPad Pro and another thing some my parents give to me are other money to actually buy an Apple pen or pencil, whatever it's called uh, But I don't know if it worth all the money because actually Apple pencil or pen are pretty expensive uh, so if you guys have an Apple Pencil or Pen, whatever it's called, be sure to tell me in the comments below if you like it or how do you feel about it, if it actually worth all the money or if you're just not happy with it, I don't know, just tell me your experience in the comments down below and yeah, I think this is all the things that I got. Well, if you like this video, be sure to give me a big thumbs up. I know that Christmas was not about a present, but I just want to share with you guys all the things that I got and I'm super happy with it. And be sure to tell me in the comments below what you got for Christmas. And also, if you're new, don't forget to subscribe because I'm going to do a very pretty video for the 2017, so I'm sure that you won't miss in them. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! And no guys, I didn't buy a new iPad Pro, this is still my first one. And basically, I did... This is the guy with the rubbish, the one that I hate. Because always when I'm filming, he comes because I have to pick up the rubbish. And I just can't film because it makes noise. And I don't know if you will be able to listen to that noise, but I'm listening, it's like... <laughs>